Welcome back to Andy's Guides. In today's video, we are going to show you how to withdraw USDT from Binance to bank account. Let's begin. Now, the first thing you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time here on Binance, click on the Get Started option. And from here, just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go. Now, withdrawing USDT or Tether from Binance to your bank account can be a practical decision. For example, remember that USDT is a stable coin pegged to the US dollars. And withdrawing it to your bank account allows you to convert it back to the fiat currency, USD or other local currency. This is very useful if you want to cash out your cryptocurrency holdings and use the funds for everyday expenses or investments. All right? Now, once you are on your Binance dashboard, I need you to click on the wallet section. So it doesn't matter if you're using the web version or the mobile device. Just click on wallet because from here you would be able to check how many balance that you can work with. And of course, the uh, UST tier that we are going to choose, which is this one, right? So we have a three ellipses option. You have the deposit. And the withdraw. Of course, we're going to withdraw the amount. Now, make sure you have already enabled your two FAs. But if not, let, let's click on the uh, later option. And from here, all you have to do is, of course, click on the uh, USTT or the Tether US, right? And make sure that you have all the sufficient amount withdrawn to your account so you'd be able to buy and sell all the tokens. To another platform all right and the currency that they are you should be you should be correct with the currency that you are using because right now i'm using the us dollars or the usd and another platform that i can look into to be able to transfer it directly to my bank account is this platform now bitso is another cryptocurrency trading platform all i have to do is create an account if you haven't done so because the thing is, in it depends on your bank really or the currency that you are working with. Now, when I try to create an account here, what will happen is all I have to do is go to the buy and sell option because they support. As you can see, this is a cryptocurrency that works as a bridge between USD and USDT, ensuring you have the best price on the market. Click on accept. Now the thing is we are going to look for the usdt right this is the tether usdt and from here right now we're going to receive the usdt converted to your local currency right and the exchange rate will matter but the thing is you need to make sure that that you have deposited the right amount of usdt to your binance account all right and then we're going to switch over to bitso and from here all i have to do is just click on enter but be mindful of the uh, charging fees or the transaction fees between both parties from binance to bitso all right and of course you need to create another platform for paypal because paypal accepts crypto right now so they have they accept a lot of um crypto from bitcoin paypal usd and ethereum and bitcoin cash and again from your paypal account once you have signed up or have a people already all you have to do is create a bank account here on paypal because i already have a bank account here now once you have the bank on the paypal associated with the cryptocurrency and bit so you would be able to receive a notification that the transaction has been completed otherwise if you haven't linked your bank on your paypal all right you might want to go here instead go here at wallet and from here as you can see just link a card or bank of course we're going to link our bank and from here you can choose to link a credit card but of course we're going to link a bank now from here all you have to do is put in your bank name your bank code and account number and once you do that you would be able to link your bank to your paypal and then link your paypal to your bit so which is connected to your binance account okay 
And always remember that when withdrawing USDT from Binance to your bank account, ensure that you follow Binance withdrawal procedures and adhere to any applicable withdrawing limits, fees, and processing times. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you in the next video.